Hey everyone, so today I wanted to show you guys a video clip of a bunch of women taking abortion pills on camera in support of abortion. Now, this isn't a bullying video, this isn't hate speech, I'm not hating on these women. This is a personal opinion video, YouTube. So basically, we all make mistakes when we are young. I grew up in a very moralist culture. I never, ever second-guessed the morality of abortion. But as you get older, typically you grow up and you realize that you were wrong about a lot of things when you were younger. One of those for me was abortion. You cannot create life without life. Abortion is murder and we're gonna look back at this time as the time where we allowed the genocide of our unborn children. It's close to a thousand abortions are performed every day by Planned Parenthood. That's not the exact statistic, but it's very close. That is genocide of our unborn children. And the only reason why our culture has normalized it is because that's what happens throughout time. Culture creates norms. And unfortunately, right now, abortion is normal and the morality of it is never questioned. So anyway, let's go ahead and watch this video of these young women who are taking abortion pills on camera in protest of pro-life people, I guess. People who don't support the genocide of unborn children. So here you go. As you guys can see, these women feel very confident to stand in front of a crowd of people and to flaunt and brag that they are able to take abortion pills in order to kill the unborn fetus. What's really interesting to me is, are these women even pregnant? Like, or are they really just doing it for show and that's their way of proving a point. I remember being on that side, and I wasn't really into politics when I was on that side, thank goodness. But, you know, it was just normal to me to think it was weird if you were pro-life. Like, I have a friend whose mother went to jail protesting abortion back in, like, the 70s. And I remember having a conversation with my friend and being like, that's so crazy. I can't believe your mom is pro-life. Like, I can't believe your mom went to jail fighting to save the lives of innocent, defenseless, unborn children. In actuality, it really is brainwashing. We are all technically brainwashed within our culture. And depending on what echo chamber you are in depends on how you're brainwashed. I talk about how I was brainwashed and I feel like I get weird responses to that, especially with my parents' generation, because I don't really think they understand the level of brainwashing, especially when you're growing up in a generation that's filled with internet and social media. They didn't really have the level of brainwashing and propaganda that we do now. And so when I talk about I was brainwashed, I was brainwashed. I think they think it's weird. I think they don't really believe truly that I was brainwashed, but really, I mean, social media, cable news, the internet are propaganda platforms. And depending on where you look, where you get your news, what your friends believe, who you hang out with, your echo chamber depends on what type of brainwashing you are in. I am happy to say that I am brainwashed morally now. I have a more moral mindset because yes we are all brainwashed but at least I'm brainwashed and I have morals I'm becoming a more moral person meaning everybody has the right to life following the Ten Commandments having a relationship with God there's nothing wrong with having a relationship with God 
again, my generation thinks it's taboo because we were brainwashed to think it's taboo. So anyway, let me know what you guys think about this in the comments and please give this video a thumbs up and have a beautiful day.